some things are hard to explain uh, works for two ways. The idea that why do you make this work in the first place? You know, and sometimes people ask us, where do you get your ideas from, or why do you, you know, why do you want to make work like this? Although we, I've thought about it a lot, we really don't know, apart from that it's trying to understand uh, how things work or how the world works, but you still try to do it. So even if you can't answer the question, it works in a second way that of translating ideas into the physical world, you know, or to making objects, or, or, or taking an idea and translating it into another medium. There's, there's a line between those two things that is, uh, and it's about the translation, and that it's not, you're never quite getting it right. There's, if there's right and wrong, but also there's a, a, a point in between those uh, where it's, it's hard to explain or it's not a clear answer. We chose four categories for the exhibition that are more or less chronological. Um, our early work was uh, performance based. Then we began to use objects more and, ju and just use the objects and maybe without a person. A lot of our work had been very sectional and just um, single moments. And we tried in later years to kind of make those flow more and so we, we uh, loosely termed, you know, it, it, a narrative, a way of joining these structures together. So that was the third section, and then the fourth section, which is the most recent work, where we were we were quite specifically looking at film, in a broad sense, but but also particularly in things like you know, mainstream, you know, American movies or or, or any or feature films, and uh, and we were looking at the kind of um, dramatic structure of those. I think because our work is, is very, it's often very minimal with the framing, we kind of see that happen in the gallery space as well, that we could create using the architecture that it is mirrored in our videos. The sets in our videos are very geometric or you know, have a window cut and, or the shape of a door. If we could build that in the gallery, uh, that then you, again you're blurring the li a line in between what's on the image and seeing it installed in the gallery, that the two of them start to mirror each other. But you just get these moments of, uh, that you can't control. Um, and for us, that was and being able to capture those things, that, that almost as well that things that you wouldn't be able to see, and make those the, the main part of the film. So again, it was taking things that are normally not considered important or not considered uh, the main part of a film and that, that we were making those the, the whole centre of the film, insignificant moments. <laughs>